Read People Like a Book by Patrick King is a guide that teaches readers the art of understanding and predicting people's feelings, thoughts, and behaviors. King emphasizes that the ability to read people is essential for anyone looking to enhance their communication skills, create stronger relationships, and achieve both personal and professional success. At the beginning of the book, King presents the foundations of human psychology and behavior, explaining that understanding others starts with being attuned to nonverbal communication, including facial expressions, body language, and tone of voice. Human beings, he points out, convey a great deal of information without saying a word, and the ability to interpret these signals accurately is key to reading people. King stresses the importance of emotional intelligence in reading people effectively. He suggests that being empathetic, managing one's own emotions, and recognizing the emotional states of others help in building rapport and establishing trust. Emotional intelligence also involves being mindful of the context in which interactions occur, as the environment can significantly influence people's behavior. Observational skills are paramount, according to King. He encourages readers to pay attention to inconsistencies between someone's words and their body language, as these can be clear indicators of deception or hidden intentions. King also notes that developing a baseline for how someone typically behaves makes it easier to notice when they deviate from their norm, which could signal that something is amiss. The author delves into the details of body language, dissecting what various gestures and postures might mean. For example, crossed arms might indicate defensiveness, while a genuine smile can signify openness and comfort. However, King cautions against jumping to conclusions based on single gestures and emphasizes the need to consider the full context and look for clusters of behavior that reinforce a particular interpretation. Facial expressions are also covered in the book, with King explaining that they are universal indicators of emotions. He references the work of psychologists like Paul Ekman, who identified seven universal facial expressions that correspond to basic emotions such as happiness, sadness, anger, fear, surprise, contempt, and disgust. King advises readers to practice observing these expressions to better understand the emotions being conveyed. Vocal cues, including tone, pitch, and speaking pace, are highlighted as important aspects of communication that can offer insights into a person's emotional state and intentions. For instance, a higher pitch can indicate excitement or stress, while a slow speaking pace can suggest that the person is trying to control the conversation or is unsure about their message. The author also explores micro-expressions, which are quick, involuntary facial expressions that reveal one's true emotions, even if they are trying to conceal them. He encourages readers to develop the skill of spotting these fleeting expressions to gain deeper insights into people's genuine feelings. Listening skills are emphasized as an essential part of reading people. King encourages active listening, which involves fully focusing on the speaker, understanding their message, responding appropriately, and remembering the information conveyed. He suggests that attentive listening also allows one to detect subtleties in conversation that can reveal the speaker's true thoughts or feelings. King points out that everyone has biases and preconceived notions that can cloud their judgment when reading others. He suggests practicing self-awareness and critically examining one's own biases to prevent them from interfering with the ability to read people objectively. The book also advises on building a more keen sense of intuition. This involves synthesizing observations and gut feelings to form a more complete picture of someone's character or state of mind. King describes intuition as a muscle that can be strengthened through practice and experience. Throughout Read People Like a Book, King provides practical exercises and tips for putting the techniques of reading people into practice. He encourages readers to apply these skills in everyday situations starting with low-stakes environments, to build confidence and proficiency. One of the final points King makes is about the ethical considerations of reading people. He emphasizes that these skills should be used responsibly and ethically with respect for others' privacy and boundaries. Reading people is not about manipulating others, but about fostering understanding and genuine connections. In conclusion, 
Read People Like a Book is a comprehensive guide that combines psychological insights with practical advice to help readers develop the ability to analyze, understand, and predict people's emotions, thoughts, intentions, and behaviors. With practice, anyone can improve their interpersonal skills and become more likable and charismatic, ultimately enhancing their relationships in both personal and professional life. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.